Hey, what's up guys? Greg Z here. Now, before I do my normal intro, I'm going to stop you right here because today is not a normal episode. Uh, well, I, have, I haven't uh, made an episode for a while and I suppose I'm going to explain that today. Uh, and also, I'm going to show you what I've been working on, not to do with these two computers here, these two AOUs. Uh, completely, completely something different and new, something quite new to me and something that I've been wanting to do for a while. So what we're going to do is just hop on over to the other world. Right, hey guys. Uh, now, as you can see here, does this look a little bit different to what you'd usually see? If we was over here, yeah. So let's have a little look at this. This is the new little guy that I've been working on. Well, I say little, it's not really too small. Um, it's nowhere near finished yet, however, however, it is very good so far. It's very quick and stuff like this. So I can kind of go over roughly what this is. We've obviously got the main memory cell here, and then this is just a secondary um, thing to do some selecting with RAM. I'll just, I, I can explain that uh, some other day. And um, we've got memory cell 1 here, memory cell 2 identically, symmetrically placed just under here. Here he is. And then down kind of round here is just general buses, input output type stuff. And then here, this big chunk with all the pistons. This looks almost like a binary decoder, but it's a RAM cell. Um, so like there's there's uh, eight different directories of RAM here. Uh, it's basically um, eight memory cells in, in one, and this is, is some of the controls for it. And then below the memory cell, we've got two secondary memory cells, and then they go into an adder so far, and then that will go into subtractors, bit decoders, and um, loads of stuff like that. I need to put in a clock somewhere. There's loads of stuff that I still need to do. Basically, I just wanted to come and show what I've been working on. Now, I haven't really put up a, a Redstone computer tutorial for a while, uh, nor, nor have I put up any other videos for a while. Now, it's my exam period at the moment, and I'm just kind of taking a break. I need to just get my head down and try and get these exams done. And as soon as they're done, I will come back to focusing on what I'd usually focus on. So, uh, making videos, especially my redstone tutorials. Um, sorry to all the redstone, tutor uh, redstone computer guys, that are, any of you that are actually waiting for uh, the next episode, which is this, really. Uh, this is just kind of like an update. But... Um, in the future, there's going to be lots of you who aren't waiting for an episode, so hey to you guys in the future. This is the main purpose of this episode, just to kind of show uh, what what one day I want to get into. So once I finish my normal ALU tutorial, I will go ahead and make an advanced CPU tutorial. So basically, all of this section up here is memory and buses, and then this section down here is going to be the CPU, and it's going to go out a little bit further. And um, then it will go into a big ROM stack. Loads of stuff like that that I'd have to explain. But uh, I thought I'd just come on, give that little update for anyone waiting, and also just to uh, kind of showcase what you you will be able to, to build and understand. Because at the moment, this looks... Um, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty happy with this so far. I'm pretty impressed with, with how I've managed to squeeze it all in. And some of the cool different functions that I've added to it already. Um, so so yeah yeah, this uh, this is all very very good, and it's all kind of a little bit experimental for me. So that's why I wanted to come on and show it. But um, so I suppose that's that, and uh, I might go ahead and record a quick Redstone computer tutorial episode because I feel bad from not having one up. It'll probably be a like a 10 minute one or something but um anyway it's exam period and i'm ill you can probably hear it as well so i'm going to end it here and um i'm sorry if there's any more lack of videos to you guys that are waiting 
and uh, to any guys in the future uh, I don't have anything to say to you apart from go ahead and watch the next episode and then be excited to be able to build this one day I, I guess <laughs> right but anyway guys thanks for watching likes comments and subscribes are all very much appreciated and if you have any ideas or complaints just go ahead and drop them in the comments because they do get read my name is Grigsy, and I will see you in the next episode of my Redstone computer tutorials. A goodbye.